A pot of paint has been flung in the face of the public. Woman with a Hat, 1905, Henri Matisse Early in the 20th century, the established, naturalistic approach to painting was challenged by artists who were driven by innovation, expression, and experimentation. These artists spearheaded the avant-garde fauve movement, producing works that were characterized by brilliant colors, often applied to the canvas straight from the tube, simplified forms, and bold execution. The movement had no explicit manifesto, its aesthetic was adopted by a loose association of friends, of whom Henri Matisse was recognized as leader. Others included André de Rain, Maurice de Vlaminck, Albert Market, Georges Rolt, and Georges Braque. The movement gained its name in 1905, at the Third Salon d'Automart exhibition in Paris, where a room full of fauvist works created uproar. Scandalized by their violent distortions of color and line, the critic Louis Vauxels described the artists as fauves, wild beasts, and the name stuck. Matisse's Woman with a Hat was singled out for particular criticism, because its colors did not correspond to reality, and its composition, with large areas of bare canvas, looked unfinished to contemporary critics. A Fauvist Summer Matisse produced Woman with a Hat in the summer of 1905, during the weeks he spent painting in the company of de Rain in the fishing village of Collier, in the south of France. It is a portrait of his wife, Amélie, dressed in a traditional ensemble, holding a fan in her gloved right hand and sporting an outsize hat. However, there is nothing traditional about the color scheme. When asked about the color of the dress his wife wore for her portrait, Matisse famously replied, black, of course. Whether that was true or he was simply being ironic, he depicts Amélie's costume as a riot of blues, greens, violets, and pinks. The elaborate hat may have been made by Amélie herself as she was a skilled milliner, its dominance in the image has a special poignancy, because the income from Amélie's millinery business kept the family afloat during the precarious years when Matisse was embarking on his artistic career. Woman with a Hat was bought by American collectors Leo and Gertrude Stein, who became the artist's first patrons. Many more would follow, boosting Matisse's morale and finances. Fauvism to Expressionism Fauvism was in many ways a transitional phase for the artists involved, but its free and expressive use of color was embraced by the German Expressionists as well as by a younger generation of artists that included the French painters Sonia and Robert Delaunay. Henri Matisse Born in 1869 in France, Henri Matisse first trained in law, and took up painting in 1891. After discovering the work of the Impressionists in 1896, he began to brighten his formerly somber palette. He adopted the neo-impressionist technique of broken brushwork, dashes, and dots. Unlike his friend Pablo Picasso, Matisse always aimed for an art of balance, of purity and serenity. He was highly versatile, producing drawings, sculpture, cutouts, and murals. He died in Nice in 1954. Other key works. 1904 Lux, Carmet Velupt. 1909-10 Dance and Music, 1949-51 The Chapel of the Rosary, Vince. In Context, Focus, Fauvism, Before. 1886-90 Vincent van Gogh Paints in Pure, Brilliant Hues, 1891-1903 Paul Gauguin Uses Anti-Naturalistic Colors Arranged in Flat Planes. 1892 Paul Signac moves to Street Drape, France, and works in a neo-impressionist style. After 1905-13 work by German expressionist group Die Brieck is typified by extreme emotion and high key color. 1907 Pablo Picasso's Les Demoiselles d'Avignon heralds the beginnings of Cubism. 1912 The term morphism is used to describe the colorful work of Frantisek Kupka and Robert and Sonia Delaunay. 